Welcome to Granny's Book Nook. Today's story is Max for President by Jared J. Krasaska. Miss Antonio announced that it was time to elect a new class president. The president will have the honor of serving our school. Max thought that he would like to be class president. So did Kelly. Max made signs that said, Max for president. Kelly made signs too. Max made buttons and gave them to all of his classmates. So did Kelly. Max made promises. If I'm elected class president, I will work to have better indoor recesses and more exciting games in the game room. Kelly made promises too. Vote for me and we will have more exciting morning announcements and better school lunches. The time came to vote. Every student could only vote for one candidate, Max or Kelly. Max waited anxiously. So did Kelly. After the ballots were collected and counted, Mrs. Antonio announced the winner. And the new class president is Kelly. Kelly cheered. Max didn't. Now, Kelly, your first job as president is to choose a good vice president. Kelly knew that she needed a good vice president to help get work done. She thought for a second and then asked, Max, would you be the vice president? I sure would. And from then on, both Kelly and Max worked hard to make their school a better place. Thank you for visiting Grammy's Book Nook. To get more information for this book, check the description box below. Be sure to thumbs up this video. Click the subscribe button for the latest videos on Grammy's Book Nook.